My name's Jimmy West. I want, I want Jimmy, Jimmy West. West. Hi. I want Jimmy West. Hi. I want Jimmy West. Yeah. And I want Jimmy West. Now I'm going to walk over to my friend group where I've had sex with all of their boyfriends and all of them individually. Jimmy West. And they know it. <laughs> I want you guys to explain how this fits into your assignment. Well, back during the human era, we had lots of different people around us. And basic bitches thought they could only be with one person. But then we met by Jimmy. And he educated us about the animations. And then it was very era specific. And then we audited the Blair Witch movie. Era specific. Movie marketing class. There's a rumor that there's like an antiviral on the market. And it will turn you into a consistent state of night vision. And this state of constant night vision will forever lock you into linearity. Sounds really stupid, right? <laughs> that sounds really stupid. Yeah, so I don't believe it. Yeah. 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 Hey, girls. I want to introduce y'all to my friend, Pac Willis. Hi, my name is Pac Willis. Sit down. Sit down. Sit down. Sit down. Sit down. Hey. Hey. Hi. 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 So. Hi, my friend. Hey. You know that table you constantly visualize because you forgot the lyrics? Oh, what? Oh my Wait, God! Did you write this for your poetry class? I kind of love poetry. Poetry? No. You own that melody, man. Oh my god. Now, I want you all to imagine that lunch table. The one that started you in preschool. Uh -huh. Oh. But it continued into your everyday flow. The glow you access into your... <laughs> <laughs> to hold other fellow articulates down. Oh. You know the one you're walking? Yes. Hey, that row. I wrote the foundation to everything you ever articulated. What the heck fucking face fuck you talk about? Oh, oh, you know what? The last time I crossed the road, someone made a joke about chicken. And those animated chickens, someone told me something really significant about them. I'm going to tell you about it right now. Oh, oh my God. That type of cool is most likely sexy. Anyways, back to my chicken story. Well, back in the human era, dinosaurs evolved into chickens. This is a fact. You know? And we do know about this. In one of the classes I teach next semester, it has to deal with the fact that dinosaurs did become chickens, and then, well, yeah, you no, know. Yeah, I know. I know all about that, yeah. I know about that. Oh, my God. Like, one of the things that we don't really talk about or people think about is after the dinosaurs devolved back into chickens, you know. Sex. What the fuck are you talking about? Whose car is that? Like, I don't know what you're talking about, but my car isn't there. <laughs> well... One of the things I know about the human era is that the sun looking on your skin and it makes you do really cool things when you're out in the club doing things with them bitches. And even when you be sucking them boyfriend's dicks, you still got them tan titties in your face. <laughs> titties in your face. And they record it. And they record it. And they record all of it. They record all of it. All of it. They record all, all of it. Them tan titties. All them tan titties. They didn't record that. They ah. recorded it. Because I didn't yes, see the did. car in the recording. Yes, I did. I want. <laughs> I miss capitalism from the era of humans because I used to capitalize on my human when I had my human things to do with chicken. <laughs> it's been six hours that I was here. Otherwise, still was here. Razor blades as a gift. I have R. Move your car and get out my face. <laughs> Finish that dinosaur story. I'll finish it. <laughs> ah. That is one of the most amazing apprentices of the classes I teach. You are a sexy teacher. Yeah, sexy teacher. We have evolved from animations. Those are our ancestors. Oh my god, this school sucks. Content is lame and I want to take Pat Willis home with me because I'm 100% straight. <laughs> So funny. That's so funny. <laughs> Especially removed from the era. It's like way funnier, right? It's like really funny. Like, 
like sexism. I mean, like the further we all move away from humanity, like sexism just becomes like the coolest style. Like so cool though. Like it has a really good style. Like, the, kind of the best style. The further we move away from it, or whatever. Sexism. We're really far away from it. Yeah, because tolerance is inevitable, right? And that's one of the things that I teach my students. Because anyway, we've evolved from animations. And these animations actually evolved from humans. Shut up! So, when we, um... So? When we, um... So, when we, um... Here. At our university, we teach people about their ancestors. And when I say people, I mean the things that you have become most recently. I want that teacher to shut up about his dumb ancestors. And I don't know what else to say. Because I hate my dumb ass teacher. And after we have successfully evolved and devolved people back again, we will have animations and because the people Ain't nothing, and we're gonna kill them all. At this university. You know what's great? Right before the second Big Bang, we were able to print weapons with a 3D printer. printer. You better shut about your dumb sci fi movie crap you be shutting, and that's not my life. (laughs) Oh, (laughs) animation. (laughs) I know how to move. Weaponized ear mustache. Thank, Thank you. you. You're welcome. Yes! They're sharp. Don't do it. Just you know don't. what's great? Right before the second Big Bang, we were able to print 3D weapons with a 3D printer, and we fucked the cops right